Volunteers of all ages are taking over the kitchen to prepare food as Operation Sandwich kicks off for the summer. It's fun to see from the littlest of people all the way up to like the old people. Like there's jobs for everybody. A site of nearly 30 volunteers a day, four times a week for three months is quite uplifting. But it all started after a saddening conversation between a local pastor and some local youth about summer vacation. Well, we like playing outside in the summer, but we don't have any food. And I was like, that's a problem. That conversation was six years ago, and now Operation Sandwich is starting their sixth summer of serving the community. ISD 181 does have a significant number of children on the free and reduced lunch program. We're at about 40% on the free and reduced lunch program. So it's important that these kids get something to eat when there are no school lunches available. In order to successfully complete Operation Sandwich, volunteers put on their gloves and pack 200 lunches a day to help make sure that local children are being fed. We like to feed children of all ages. Um, it is not an income-based program. Anyone is welcome. A sack lunch filled with a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, a piece of fruit, a granola bar, and one other snack item. It's fun to just be able to give out food to whoever needs it without having to ask questions. Volunteers are spread out at eight locations Monday through Thursday all summer long. We do send additional supplies with all of our volunteers so that if they do encounter an allergy, they can make a sandwich on the spot. And next week we hope to have um, some gluten-free options as well. Thanks to Operation Sandwich, last year 8,000 meals were handed out in Brainerd, and this year they are on track for similar numbers. For this week's Community Spotlight, in Brainerd, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News.